And now we return to the Cyber Realm with DigiJax90 versus Chad the Gamer in a rematch. This is a new intro. Okay, I kind of dig that. Not even gonna lie. Then again, there's something about the original Yu Gi Oh! theme that will just always hit, though. But that could just be the nostalgia of all the thing. We show everyone their epic decks. I like how freaking Zarvox just gets a fan made archetype of his. They're gonna get. I guess that's kind of a sign, like, if Zarbox is in the episode, we're doing fan duels. Or custom cards, at least. You know, it's a guarantee. Grogar's Wrath. Hmm. Chod's Star Power. That doesn't sound like the gamer. Alright. I have dual played some opponents, including a certain them. Although, I feel like something is missing. What do you mean? Well, to be honest, it has been a while since I have dueled with the others when Dark Critic was my only threat. You mean, like Jordan Leno Comics and Chad? Yes. So, I'm actually thinking about having a rematch with all of them before dueling with any new opponents. Hmm. Well, except for you, Dark Critic, since I've already had a rematch with you a little while back, and Dark Critic is already in the venting zone. For now. Oh. I would personally recommend asking them to join with you against Grogar and his lackeys and stuff. I did when like the time uh, comes. Zarabox's reaction. He's like, ugh. That's something this again. I'm already aware of ever since I first thought of this idea. Anywho, I will be doing all of them in order. So the first one up is Char. So I'm gonna go ahead and find him. Alright, I'll stay in the side bear realm like usual. See you soon, Zarabox. Hmm. I do like that Zervox walks away because you could have just let them stay in there and we wouldn't have cared. <laughs> Extra bit of effort. What a great day! I wonder where Dizzy's been. He hasn't been by the shop lately. Looking the stuff in the uh, thing. I know he's got Pokemon Sun and Moon. Oh, bye! <laughs> Need to start mm -hmm. with Mario Land and Come World, in. maybe. The shop's open. Uh, and there's a miner? As a customer? Well, well then, this is a new one. Hey, I'll do this one every day. <laughs> Welcome to Star Power Games, where it's all games, all the time. <laughs> Uh, what brings you here, big guy? Chad, it's me, Digi. D Digi? What the heck happened to you? Um, that's a long story. Let me guess. Dark Critic. Yes. It would just assume it's the evil being. How the hell do you know about it? Pretty safe bet, that'll be fair. <sighs> I had an encounter with him myself. He seems to be the kind of guy to pull something like this. I don't really remember him encountering you. I well, how would you remember him encountering me? Avatar, Moon Knight, Crimson Wind, and Jordan Lego Comics, since they were his victims. Hmm, that's true. Well, to put yeah, it nicely, one. he tried coming after me, but when he did, it's like something inside me drove him back, causing him to leave. I still don't know what happened there. I see. Yeah, sorry. It was off screen. Dude. Oops. Sorry for the fourth wall break. <laughs> right. So, what brings you to my shop, Dizzy? That's simple, buddy. I want to have a rematch with you. A rematch? Hmm. Well, my warriors and spellcasters haven't seen some action in a long time. Sure, I accept your rematch. <laughs> That's good. For a little while, I've been dealing with new opponents that I actually had a feeling that you and some of the others I dealt a while back wanted to have a rematch with me at some point, and I felt like I would forget if I were to kept on dealing with more new ponies. Wait, so I'm the first one? Well, yeah. You were my first opponent yeah, yeah, when yeah, I was yeah, about yeah, to get 
in my in, in, video after forgetting about it for so many years. That's true. What's a Yu-Gi-Oh? Well, thank you for letting me be your first rematch, buddy. What are you gonna use? Your good old dragons? Well, that's the thing. I really don't know. Originally, I was planning to use Cancellers again, but hmm. as of now, I'm not for sure. They're kind of really dated. Dragon for a while. Hmm. Tell you what. I'll the sellers are still a good knife, but it's also one of those Let things where just like they've got. been, you know, mm -hmm. it's a time. Like power creep has really just destroyed oh, them. Here's one. I can play Jirax at what at some point for fun. I'm just like, if this card destroyed my battle, if this card destroyed my battle, if this card, oh my god, this is so 2011. Yep, that is the Yang it was, Zing deck. It wasn't even that long ago and feels ancient. Very fun deck. From what I see, not only that, but it's also Menifees, Draco, and True King. Mm. Oh yeah. So, you ready to duel Digi? Wait, Metaphys. Metaphys. We can go to the That's how I pronounce game, it at least. But I want to warn you, Chad. It's different from the last time you went. All right. Can't be any more different than you are. Let's be real here, folks. <laughs> after customers brought, after costumers. Oops. Whoa! You weren't kidding! This looks awesome! Let's be real here, folks. If your friend turned into another species, I think your friend's house being another, being looking a little different would really throw you off that much. Yeah, sorry that happened to you, buddy. But the new Cyber Realm looks great! Where's Zarvox, anyway? Hi, John. Ah. Oh, hey, Zarvox. Wait. Zarvox? What the heck? Dizzy? What in the world is going on here? While you were away, well, except for that time when you were busy with Diabolus, at some point I filled Zarvox and Android Pony Body to host. So wait, you asked where Zarvox was, but was you didn't think he had a physical form? Oh, I see. Well, I'm what was glad he you like to hang out with us now, was he Zarvox. Like just Sorry about my freak out. I don't know. I've just seen wall or so something? many surprising things. Well, you were busy with What do you think? Something. What was he? How so 9,000? It shouldn't come as a shock to me. Yep. So, should we get this duel underway? Yeah. Like last time, I'll be on the left while you can be at the right. You got it, buddy. Let's duel. Get your game on. I'll allow you to go first, Chad. Thanks, Dizzy. I start off by summoning Rodney Captain. Then I use the skill to special summon a level 4 or lower monster from my hoof. So I special summon Demonio. I set two cards face down, and then my turn. You're up, Dizzy. Well, I usually don't like to summon, but I guess I can give it a I'll set my pendulum scale with Madison's Key Coin Dragon and then send for you, Secret of the Yang Z. Okay. With send for you on the pendulum scale, I can only pendulum summon Yang Z and Safran monsters. Luckily, I have three Yang Zings in my paw. I will pendulum summon Totai, Tsuyani, and Kaolo. You, you pendulum summon to level one? Sandy's sake. Your sacrifice will not be in vain, soldier. It is now. All right. No more text. Draw. Okay. I activate Pot of Greed. I activate Magical Dimension, oh boy. which lets me tribute my Gemini Elf to special summon my Dark Magician! Of course. And thanks to Magical Dimension's effect, I can destroy one monster on the field. So I destroy Tauti. Of course, level 5. I'll 
I'll activate both ice effects. Whenever it's destroyed by a battle or a card effect, I can special summon one other Yangzing monster from my deck and defense to see. The Yangzings are balanced by one simple thing. They're all wins. Well, I said the card face if down. If they had been it, it would have been a far more powerful archetype. Drop. The take got screwed so I hard. Pot of now, I will set one of the cards. <laughs> you guys see these pots of green? I'm just imagining Jordan like Okami in the background. Yes, so fucking yes! True King Adamazar, the Banisher. Now, with both monsters destroyed, I can special summon another Syrian and special summon Chi Wing. Yep, that's Yang Zing's specialty. How are you liking it so far, buddy? Well, I find this deck pretty cool. Anyways, I'll have Agmanzad attack your Dark Magician. I guess figure this thing out pretty quickly. Meanwhile, I'm still like, I must, I'm still learning combos with my deck. With half my cylinder. decks. I'll chain that with nine pillars of Yang Zi. Huh? Oh, counter trap. <laughs> Wait, is he gonna drop all nine pillars? Oh, thank God. And then the Yang Zing went with it. He said, like, trip the Yang Zing. Before I continue the attack, since my Chi Wen was destroyed by the effect of nine pillars of Yang Zing, I can special summon Sofax in attack mode. Oh boy. And since Sofraxi was special summoned, it's a pendulum. I can target Serenity, and it becomes a tuna. Oh. You're making me so proud, Dizzy. Thanks, Chad. Anyways, I'll have Sofraxi attack you directly. Fine, bitch! Fucking laser eyes! Now, before I end my turn, it's time for a synchro. I will tune with Tsunami. With Sufaxi, so and the Yang Zing summon. Yazi, evil of the Yang Zing. Okay. Now, since I use Sufaxi as synchro material, I know there's no ban list, but isn't this the banned band one? I'm just, I'm not gonna be. Draw. I just asked for clarification. I another pot of greed. I activate Dark Hole. Kaboom! Huh. That makes it look like they're gonna be Xyz summoned. With a card effect, I can add one more monster huh. that isn't a fire attribute. It looks cool, but I'm like, that doesn't look like a freaking dark hole. Well, or it looks more like an Xyz summon. Now I summon Alexandra oh, hey, Dragon. Now attack Dizzy directly. I set the car face down, and it's your move, Dizzy. Draw! I'll activate Yang Zing Power. By targeting three Yang Zings from my graveyard, I can shuffle them back into my deck and draw two cards. Hmm. Now, I will summon... Yang Zings have their own pot of avarice. With a normal summon, I can ban three cards from the top of my deck, and they gain 300 tech for each of them. Each Metaphys card. Wow, three in a row. Anyways, I have Rock and Rock attack. Watch the smiles on you. Nice. Okay, so we had the Ragnarok and then the Thunderstruck. Something tells me someone really liked Thor 3. I'll activate Rock and Rock's effect. How does there be anything wrong with that? I don't know if Ron's with Thor 3. I didn't see I can it. I special summon a level 5 or higher mana piece monster from my deck. But I'll have to banish the Dream the End phase. I will special summon Maxine Tiger Dragon. Due to it being special summoned by a mana piece monster, it can't be affected by traps. So I'll have Tyrant attack you directly! Crap. Burn to the ground! Out! And now it's slicing him, you know, like most dragons do. 
I'll end my turn at that. Bye. Draw. Oh boy, I hope this works. I activate Graceful Charity, which lets me draw three cards as long as I discard two cards. I activate my last pot of greed. Oh my Celestia! Yes! The fifth piece of Exodia! First off, I activate Call the Haunted to bring back Dark Magician. Now, I activate Polymerization. Diffuse Dark Magician and Buster Blader to form the ultimate magical swordsman. Dark Paladin! Oh boy. I haven't fused some of this guy in a decade. Really? Now, Dark Paladin, attack Ragnarok! Uh oh, and it's getting fire to attack for every dragon when fighting Yang Zings! Oh wait, Yang Zings are worm types. So close. And with that, I end Excuse my turn. Excuse me for thinking that the dragons are are, are dragons, but so would be dragon types. But no, they're worm types. I know dragons and worms are typically classified differently in mythology and all that jazz. But still, it's like really, you need no. two types of dragons. Draw. That is a cool effect, Dizzy. I like that. I will summon. And again, this is the series that has beast, and warrior, and beast warrior, counter, which gives him and fish and aqua type. Mm. Then, like I can remove the spell counter to destroy one spell or trap card, and I choose to destroy your face you down think at one card. I think at one point, Break was considered a broken card, because it could have 1900 attack points and BMST. Okay, I had to have one or the other, but still. Aw, oh, man, Breaker's only 1600. I should have remembered that Worms got pretty good defense. Mm. Dark Paladin, attack Pualo. I'm waiting for attacking with the weaker monster, because you know the moment you attack with the weaker monster, some of the monsters that's a face down. When you attack with the weaker monster, the monster's face down has higher defense. If you, well, if you had attacked it with the monster with higher attack, some of the defense would have been minuscule. I know that's not how that works in the slice, but it's oh, that just seems okay. to be the luck, you know? Well, I set the car face down, and it's your turn, buddy. Draw! I'll first activate Foolish Burial. I will send Menace's Tyrant Dragon to the graveyard. Next, I'll activate Pot of Green. Now, I will Pendulum Summon Suany and another Teltan. Okay. All right, I'll have Totai attack Dark Paladin. But during the damage step, I'll activate Yang Z Fatality. Oh boy. Holy! It's limiter removal. I know what that does. It doubles the attack and defense during the damage step. Doesn't mean much when you have zero defense, I though. I that happen. I activate With zero times two. Cylinder. Oh, well, you said during the damage step. Ruling in the next step wouldn't work because Magic Cylinder came in. Oh, now we're going to check the rulings, Mr. Mr. I Pendulum Summit at level one. You gotta be kidding me. In this universe, Magic Cylinder is meta. Then again, I can't blame you. Magic Cylinder is arguably better than Mirror well, Force, because if you use Mirror Force, you set off like 19 floating effects. Magic Cylinder just burns and, and goes away. I draw. I tribute my Breaker the Magical Warrior to summon the lovely Dark Magician Girl. Now, I will have Dark Magician Girl. I'm pretty sure there's a law out there with deck building that you're not allowed to make a casual spellcaster deck without a Dark Magician Girl. Or a Dark Magician at the very least. I saw the fact that Konami once released a, a spellcaster structure deck with that had a monster that could be special summoned by tributing a Dark Magician. But the and Dark Magician wasn't in the deck, in the structure deck. I will special summon Good job. You put a monster in there, you couldn't even, we couldn't even summon. I feel like Jade and Yuki when I'm doing this, but I activate Solemn oh. Judgment, paying half of my life points to negate Jade the and you Solemn of one time in all the against Jinzo. A 
A small Actually, price to pay for time, keeping my dark position girl safe. Yeah, keep the wife safe, everybody. I will special summon Bixie in defense mode. Dark Paladin, attack Bixie! Cup Bixie is just a clearly a turtle. Turtles can be dragons. Actually, in Chinese mythos, they probably are handy. I will special summon my own. But why did you attack my defense monster? You could have just finished me off by attacking my Totai monster. Well, I wanted to have some fun in this duel, buddy. It's like I say, it's all about having mm. fun. I see. Yeah, I remember that when I play any game. I know losing sucks, the pain is real, but then I remember the most important rule about playing games. Having fun. Hmm. What fun is there in being that OTK'd? That reminds me when Avatar and Mitra and Blitz were telling me about the whole having fun part. And then oh, I got yeah. OTK'd go by Metadex. Have fun. Now with that, I end my turn, and it's all you, buddy. Draw! I'll see the card and switch my monsters to defense mode. Go mm. ahead. I draw. This is close, buddy. But first, I will have Dark Paladin attack. Activate Ring of Destruction. Oh boy. Oh no! Wait, who are you using it on? Paladin. Uh oh. Dark Paladin. Wait, if this happens, then that would mean. And in this duel, and a draw. Have fun! It had chose! Uh, oh man, I didn't see that coming, Dizzy. Ring of Destruction in the Yang Zing deck? I don't remember putting that card in. Hmm. Maybe it was a recent addition I forgot about? Maybe, but it felt like it was a good time to use it when I drew that card. Probably a yeah, pre Yeah, we ring ended of in a draw. That was a fun duel, Dizzy. <laughs> Same here, Troy. Because TCG Yu-Gi-Oh! So, hates what draws. are you doing after this, buddy? Uh... I'm thinking about just taking a little break and then continue my rematch marathon with Shoujo being next. I'm thinking about taking nice. a break. You just started. I look forward to seeing it. And speaking of which, I heard that you're having some trouble. What's bugging you, buddy? Oh. Well, ever since I've dueled with Twilight, I've been asking my other friends to see if they would like to help me against Grogar and his possible army. Speaking about that, you want to join me when that time comes? Grogar, huh? Sure, buddy. You can count on me. He'll regret ever messing with Sweet. us. Sweet. Um, Digi, one of your cards here is glowing in a rapid succession. I'm sure that's a good sign. Really? Here, have a look. Stream? I've never seen cards glow like that. Yeah. I wonder what this glowing in a rapid succession means. I'm not sure, Digi. Maybe Jordan would know something about this. Well, he might. I'm gonna have to talk with him once I actually get to him. True. How about we go back to my shop? I can order some pizzas from Jasper's Pizzeria. Good idea. And I got lots of different kinds of pop in the coolers in my shop. Especially... Got soda, beer, and heat oh. tab. Let's go! <laughs> you said the magic word. Something stuck inside dr stream dragon ruler droplets. Hmm. Well, that's certainly interesting.